you might have noticed it was a bit of a poll for the best dressed and worst dressed people. Now, there were some pretty interesting results. We decided to head out onto the streets and find out what you think, and here's what happened. Excuse me, we're just asking people who they think are the best and worst dressed people in Australia. Do you have any opinions in that area? Oh, yes, I do. Yeah. Who do you think is the worst? Susan Renouf. Really? We've got a picture of her here. What do you make of that outfit? I think she always puts everything she owns on at once. What about, say, Danny Minogue? What do you think of her? Disgraceful. Oh, well, she put on everything she owned at once. I think that'd be doing us all a favour, wouldn't it? <laughs> you know what? I'd, I'd rather see Danny Minogue with a, with a fashion accessory like this. <laughs> I think I think that's really sensible from a young rock star. When you get to Riot, you have to have one like that. Now, what about, say, Elton John? Do you think he's well dressed? No, I don't like his new image, actually. Mm. Not at all. You'd be talking about this image here. Yes. <laughs> what, 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 particularly, about that what particularly about that does not appeal to you? The pants and the boots and the hair and the jacket. Has to go, all. <laughs> but just the rather alluring hint of stomach over the belt, don't you think? It's <laughs> always a turn on. <laughs> Not for me, no, no. Delilah considers herself something of a doyen in the fashion industry. Delilah, could you give us your thoughts on uh, some of some of Australia's leading personalities in their dress sense? Elle McPherson, for example. Oh, yeah, she's all right. Who would you class as Australia's worst-dressed person? Bloody Jeff Kennett. It's also one of those things, without all these fancy dresses, maybe nobody noticed him. That's, that's the catch. See, well, what he really needs, really, honestly, is some sensible shoes and some long socks, doesn't it? Yeah, well, look, uh, <laughs> it's not necessary that everybody does the same. What about Elton John? No. What about this outfit here? What are you, what's he thinking there, do you reckon? Is that the kind of outfit you'd wear yourself? <laughs> not at all, not at any time, but... You know, that gives a lot of people pleasure. It's interesting, it's different, it's way out. And would you uh, wear that for a dare? I probably would. <laughs> really? Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. we just happen to have that outfit in the car. <laughs> well, I'm not going to. <laughs> what about, say, the Wild West? Does that look appeal to you? Yes. Say, for example, that look there. Is that the kind well, of... it keeps the sun off the head. Danny Minogue, for example. No. Daryl Hannah. What do you think of Daryl Hannah? I think Daryl Hannah looks great, actually. I always like what she wears. But sometimes she loses it, doesn't she? No, <laughs> she looks great. I think, there. no, fantastic, really. She's got a great body for it, yeah. But what sort of event or occasion <laughs> would that be an appropriate outfit for, Bernadette? Definitely an indoor modelling... Um, so, not for a funeral? For no. Example. Family reunions? <laughs> Excuse me, we're conducting a poll. Who do you think is Australia's worst-dressed person? Australia, at the present time, we have too many... Parliament members, starting the federal, and uh, the Parliament members are standing on the ground. They should be second half. Let them go out to the bastard. Yes, but who do you think is Australia's worst dressed person? Worst dressed. What about Daryl Summers? Uh, do you think he's good dresser I, or? I don't watch him that much. No. Um, doesn't he get his jumpers off you? Who well, would you regard as, as one of Australia's best dressed people? Oh, well, I know, say, Gilligan. You'd obviously think Gilligan was a very well dressed person. I think it's our time, Mr. Keating. Mr. Keating. A beautiful suit on. Every time I look at him, he looks out of this world. Would you prefer, say, the Prime Minister's suit to that particular one over there? Ah, oh, no. That's nothing. Look at him. He looks like a schmatter. 